What's up you guys, your boy Perver Senpai here and today I'm going to be reacting to The Devil is a Part-Timer Season 2 Episode 7. So far in this anime, it's been, you know, quite good the progress of the plot and, you know, some people may not really like it as much because of how, well, maybe how slow the pace is at times. On the last episode, they kind of left us on a cliffhanger when Peep was saying that Emmy was like the new powerful person in the beach that was like knocking out the demons over there. I did have my suspicions on the last episode at the very beginning when Amain went like out in the beach by herself while the others were just staying in the place of their home. And then after seeing demons getting like knocked over by wind and Amain wasn't like to be seen and she know like she knew a lot of the history of the beach. I kind of connected two and two together and then it kind of showed more later on when the peep said like oh wait that's the lady that tried to kill us and i was like bam i'm a genius i'm a goddamn genius but if you guys do happen to enjoy my reaction on today's episode why not hit the like it helps me push this type of content mine up to other people that may like the same stuff as you guys do and also if you guys been seeing more of my content lately and actually been enjoying it more than you usually have been and want to see some more in the future why not hit the subscribe button if you guys haven't already but that's pretty much all i gotta talk about let's hop on to today Today's episode. Okay, so let's see how Maho is gonna handle this situation now that he knows that you know Main is the person that was defending the demons. <laughs> hey, you know that's a very detailed castle sand. I wish I could do that, man. That is very awesome to see. So some of those just like taking it all in what to do about anime with Emmy. I feel like that lighthouse has something to do with this. I have a feeling. Because we've been seeing the lighthouse a lot of times throughout the last episode until right now. I I feel like they shouldn't be fighting a main, but I feel like there's could be no other choice. Oh a human meeting the demon realm. That is kinda of strange. Oh shit, sure. so the demon like capital was split into two. So that human was trying to like manipulate them, I guess, by coming to the realm to avenge the Satan guy. Oh, wait, yeah, that was him. So it just took them to this beach. Oh shit, so a huge army is gonna be coming soon? Oh, that's kind of bad. Damn, okay, so he's saying a main may be able to like take down the army that's about to come tonight. Damn, that's actually pretty cool. <laughs> yeah, you better take your responsibility, man. You gotta take your responsibility. Hey, you know what? As much as Emmy is a Tsunzere, at least she, well, somewhat believes Sana, though. Oh, what the heck? Oh, what the heck's coming out? Oh, damn. Okay, that's a lot of them. So, Emmy could be able to take all of that? A thousand? A thousand of them? Wait, what the heck is she taking? Is she taking a power energy drink? Wait. Where's the sword? Wait, so they gotta go back to the apartment to get the sword, huh? Oh my god. Uh-oh. Uh, Whoa. Okay, man, that's, they just laid, she just laid it all out there. That's right, Sato. You gotta take responsibility. And that's a actually pretty cool looking sword, damn. Okay, so I mean, this is not our enemy, it looks like great darkness oh she's considered to be called great darkness interesting <laughs> all right i like her a lot more now <laughs> so main is technically like not going to be helping but it's going to be helping the devil but she's more on the side of emmy and the other girl but she wants to see if you know sato is going to take responsibility for this event that has been happening oh wow they uh they could multiply oh damn Oh shit. Okay, I don't think. Well, okay, maybe Demi does need help. There's a lot of people. What the heck? What's happening? Why is she in a purple shield? Is it like identifying her? Hmm. So that little emerald thing is actually pointing out like there's a power piece of the sword. Whoa, what's with her hair? Yo! What? Silver hair? Wait, did that happen before? Like Emmy, she she's like not trying to kill them, but if it comes to it, she would have to kill them at the end. Was that what the devil? What? He transformed? Oh damn! Okay, they all transformed. Okay, it looks like they're actually taking responsibility and making sure that they don't come back to the human world instead, just sending them back to well the 
demon worm. Actually, this is a really smart way to, you know, instead of like finding them, to show them proof that they're still alive. So now they could like go back to the demon realm without needing to fight. I'm actually curious how long Maho is able to like keep his Satan form intact right now. Oh, hey, she's able to keep it. Nice. Okay, it looks like we'll be able to track more of the sacred sword pieces. Okay, this is actually a really a win-win right here because not only does he stop a fight, but he's also able to like, send the men back and tell them that Satan is still alive. Don't let the door hit you all the way. What the heck? Whoa, what the heck? The, what's the lighthouse light doing? Oh my god, they're just sending them back just like that. Alright, well that was thing to handle. Very mature way to handle things. Oh, oh yeah, I forgot Satan was holding at me. <laughs> I like these little moments about Emmy and Maho, like, you know, working together in these certain moments. All right, it looks like everything's everything's done. And it looks like Amain didn't have to do anything. She just needed to watch over the gentleman to take responsibility. <laughs> uh, so it looks like they all fell in the water, it looks like. Oh, it kind of makes sense. Once they close the realm, I think they lost their uh, power or their transformation and they all fell. Okay, you know what? Emmy changed a lot in this episode, I feel like. What? Well, no, they can't work here no more? Damn. Whoa, what the fuck? Yo, who is that? Oh, yo, okay, okay, this is kind of freaky. Oh shit, so it's like the, I guess the lost souls, I guess. Mmm, okay, that makes sense because of their powers that it stopped being balanced and it went kind of overboard. <laughs> At least it's still like getting a bonus. Oh shit, looks like they still got a mission to do. Okay. Wait, what the heck? Wait, where, where the heck happened? Oh, money. 50,000 yen? Hey, not bad. So, like, did a main like take all like the restaurant place? Yeah, this episode kind of like changed a lot of people's perspectives on things. It looks like I like how they're like enjoying these things that they're seeing in this world and compared to their demon realm. <laughs> uh, I like this kind of rivalry and friendly competition that they have right now. Oh, yo, wait, the way he said it. <laughs> yo, the way he said that. <laughs> Sound like he was gonna dominate Emmy in a way. Time to review today's episode. So for a main, she kind of is the person that's like the guardian of that area because her and her father are like, I forgot what's called, Odin Earth guardians i think that's what they call it but so then they just guard that place and somehow some of the demons you know they started appearing in that area more and more because someone called odin i think that's his name or old man osali i think he pretty much told the demons like oh yeah the demon king is dead and so like you guys should try to get revenge and so the faction of the demon realm of the demon army kind of split into two and so half of them believed that satan was actually dead and so they went after the sacred sword pieces to you know fight back and get revenge and that kind of caused i mean some kind of trouble because they would always land in the place where she's like was guarding it because so uh, some of the demons would show up there because they had like a little guide type of crystal that would help them locate the uh, missing the shards of the sword but yeah main she's actually very strong but she decided to let you know maho to like clean up his own mess or you know take responsibility and to a main if he didn't or couldn't take responsibility well she was gonna take care of it herself with maho included at first it seems like she's like friendly to them but she's only friendly because she wants them to clean up their own mess but she's actually allies with Emmy and the other lady. And another thing that surprised me was that Emmy was transforming into something else. And not only her hair, but her personality, like her way of thinking and things. Because I believe in the last season, all she did was try to, well, murder the guys and just take out the demons as soon as they appear. But in this one, she kind of like just hold it back a bit so then she could get either some intel or find a way to send them back without needing to kill them but of course i mean if things go out of hand of course she's gonna go to option two and you know kill the demons but luckily you know satan maho he was able to get things straight with the other demons making them see that he's still alive but now it looks like that the satan group 
has now two missions and I think one of the missions is to help and rebalance on what happened at the beach of the people with the lost souls or the soul of the dead and their other mission is to find the you know sacred pieces of the sword left and with the guidance of that crystal that they just got from the demons it looks like it's gonna be a lot easier this time around but if you guys happen to enjoy my reaction on today's episode why not hit the like button it helps me push this type of content of mine up to other people that may like the same stuff as you guys do and also if you guys been seeing more of my content lately and actually been enjoying it more than you usually have been and want to see some more in the future why not hit the subscribe button if you guys haven't already but that's pretty much all i gotta talk about it's been your boy perverted senpai and i'll see you guys in the next episode